So Jesus says in verse 34, my soul is overwhelmed with sorrow to the point of death. He said to them, stay here and keep watch. Jesus anticipates what's coming. This is the deepest sorrow Jesus ever had to endure. Was it because he was rejected by his people, all of Israel, the people he came to save? Was it because Judas betrayed him? Was it because of the religious leader's refusal to believe in him? What Maybe it was because he didn't want to go through his impending torture and death. No, none of those. He would soon take on the sin of the world. For the first time in history, God, his father, would reject him. He would become the object of God's wrath. He himself would be the guilt offering for sinners. There are two famous gardens in the Bible. What are they? Yeah, Garden of Gethsemane and the Garden of Eden. The first Adam in the Garden of Eden disobeyed God through the whole, through the whole human race into sin. The last Adam was in the Garden of Gethsemane where God placed him. The first Adam sinned and we lost our right to the tree of life. The last Adam, Jesus, took that sin upon himself and hung on a tree at Calvary to restore the tree of life to all who believe. There are two extremes. 2 Corinthians 5.21, which we sang, God made him who knew no sin to what? To be sin for us so that in him we might become the righteousness of God. 